Hello and welcome to my channel, Lord Ravi. Today I'm just going to show you a pattern to prime numbers which I discovered. I'm just putting this video up. Uh, I discovered it first. I'm taking credit for it. I mean, I've from what I've seen, no one's really ever found much of a pattern to prime numbers. They like think most people would say that they're random, but I actually found a sequence which is basically a pattern to prime numbers. And today I'm just going to share that with you guys. And I actually discovered this about like more, more than a year ago, almost two years ago. But now I'm just finally revealing to you the pattern to prime numbers. So the pattern to prime numbers. You guys ready for this? Alright, so we all know what prime numbers are. It's just any number which can only be divided by itself and 1. So obviously the first prime numbers are 2, 3, 5, 7, 11, 13, 17. And keeps going on. A lot of people think the prime numbers just go on randomly, but there's actually a sequence so I'm going to be showing you guys today. So if you look up online a uh, prime number pattern or the pattern for prime numbers, basically what you find is they just can predict uh they have a way to sort of predict the probability of where prime numbers will be exact like but there's no they don't really have any specific um, perfect pattern and this isn't exactly a perfect pattern either this is more of a sequence really than a pattern it's just a strange little sequence which keeps appearing in prime numbers so um, yeah obviously prime numbers start with two and then it goes up one to three, up two to five, goes to seven, eleven, thirteen, keeps going every single number which can only be divided by itself. And uh this keeps going right, right, right. And so those are the prime numbers, but the pattern uh the pattern sequence which I discovered is not just in the prime numbers but in the gaps between the prime numbers so basically the distance numerical distance in between each prime number can be listed as they're called prime gaps so here are the first some of the first prime gaps It goes 1, 2, 2, 4, 2, 4, 6, 2, 6, and keeps going on and on. It might seem sort of random, these gaps in between primes, but actually there's a very distinct pattern sequence. So the sequence is basically this 4, 2, 4, 2, 4 part, and this just keeps on repeating. Obviously, I'm going to go into more, I'm going to show more about the sequence, but the the um main part of it is this little 424 four, which keeps appearing but it's not just that it's so first of all let's just look at this 424 four. this is basically the beginning part of the sequence which will just keep on repeating so it goes 424 four, 626 six, and then 424 four again 6626 six, six. so there 424, 626. Six. That's the first part. And then 424, 6626. Six, six. So obviously that repeated right there. And then it, it goes, and then there's another 424 four right here. 424, 2414. Four, and then another 424. Four. Just 424 four keeps on repeating. This one's 6210. And then. 626 six. again and then this is only the first 60 but there's if you just keep looking at the gaps that 424 four will just keep on coming up and that's the first part of the sequence alright now I will finally reveal to you the pattern sequence in the prime numbers okay so if, let's look at the prime gaps which is the distance the numerical distance in between each prime number and the first couple of prime gaps are as follows. 1, 2, 2, 4, 2, 4, 
4246626426626426628 and so on keeps going all right so now if we just write that down simply list all the prime gaps and then just group them in these columns we find the pattern so it starts off with 1 2 2 these are the first 3 prime gaps the distance in between 2 and 3 is 1 the distance between 3 and 5 is 2 the distance between 5 and 7 is 2 the distance between 7 and 11 is 4 so and so on so then it goes 4 2 4 2 4 6 2 6 so this is the original sequence 4 2 4 2 4 6 2 6 and then throughout the pattern this keeps coming up over and over again it just gets more and more diluted the further you go down the prime numbers so but it does keep repeating this sequence and that's proven I'll show you that right now so right after that 626 6 comes another 424 4, which is another beginning this starts the second line okay so then 24 is ex the same value as 2 plus 4 is the same value as 6 and then another 626 6, and then 426 start okay and then it goes 468 and then we have another 424 4, so that's the, this is the third line of the sequence so this is 424 2, 4 again, so that 2 plus 4 is 6, so these are all 6s right here. And then 14, and then 4, 6, 2, which is these reversed, so this is obviously parallel to that. After this 4, 6, 2 on the third line, continue on to the fourth line, and it's 10, 2, 6, which is relevant because 10 plus 2 plus 6 is 18, and if you look right above, 4 plus 6 plus 8 is also 18, so it's still following that pattern. This is 18, both of those. And this, 6 and 4. So 4 plus 2 is 6, and then 4, 4. So there's a total value of 10, and it sticks with that 4, 2, 4 pattern, actually. And this does that again. 2 plus 4 is 6, so these are all 2, 4s, and 6s. So there's another 6 right here. Next is 6, 2, 10, and then 2, 4, 2, and then on to the fifth line of the sequence. So we get 12, 12, which is similar to this beginning one, 1, 2, 2. So 12, 12, another 4, 2, 4. This is how you know how to align the sequence is these 4, 2, 4s. And then another 6. Remember this 2 plus 4 is 6, so we keep getting 6 right here. And then a 2, 10, 6, which is the reverse of this one, the previous one. 6, 2, 10, now it's 2, 10, 6. And then that's this pattern just keeps on repeating. You can keep on adding lines. So yeah, um, so basically this is just an amazing little sequence that just keeps repeating and all these things match up perfectly all the numbers match up in the sequence if you look at this 14 so 14 plus 4 plus 6 plus 2 is the same as 14 plus 12 which is 26 so these so these two together have 26 and this right here 18 which is 6 plus 2 plus 10 plus 8 uh, is another 26 so these are both 26 and then over here this is 4 plus 6 plus 8 makes 18 and then this is 10 plus 2 plus 6 makes 18 as well and yes this pattern does keep on repeating